Hi, I'm Marilyn Dalton with the Medical Assisting Technology Program here at Northeast Alabama Community College. I'm the program director and uh, an instructor for our courses. Um, we have uh, medical assisting is a career where you primarily work in a physician's office. Uh, the person that takes you back, who registers you, this is a medical assistant. And um, so you learn the skills for all of the uh, physician's office, uh, from the front office, registration, uh, payroll, uh, office manager, uh, medical billing and coding, uh, insurance. And then you also learn the skills of the clinical side, or we call it the back office, where you are taking the patient back, uh, getting their vital signs, finding out why they're here, uh, to see the doctor, uh, assisting the doctor in setting up um, the room, um, exams, uh, you learn different instruments, uh, set up for excisions, pap smears. Uh, you also learn labs. So you're doing your analysis, um, chemistry profiles, uh, blood sugars, EKGs, you're giving shots, so you have to learn about medications. Uh, we have a pharmacology course, and um, also phlebotomy. That's one of our biggest draws, <laughs> is a short-term certificate in phlebotomy. We have students who uh, maybe they're not sure if they want to be a medical assistant, but they start out as a phlebotomist. So they take lab one, lab two, phlebotomy preceptorship, where you go actually to the hospital or a doctor's office and draw blood on real patients. And uh, you also um, have EK, uh, CPR and EMS 100. And so you can take that, you can become nationally certified as a certified phlebotomy tech, uh, go to work, uh, part-time or full-time and complete your medical assisting degree. So we've had some students to do that. Um, at the end of our Associate in Applied Science degree in medical assisting, which usually takes six semesters, um, just depends on your work schedule and, and how many classes you take, you are eligible to then um, take the national certification to be a uh, certified clinical medical assistant. Um, other options we have are short-term certificates in medical coding, which is kind of my specialty. <laughs> so um, we have uh, coding classes there, and you can also become nationally certified as a certified coder um, through either American Health Information Management Association or the uh, American Academy of Professional Coders. Uh, that's another option. Uh, we also offer EKG um, short-term certificate, and that can be, some of the classes you take as a medical assistant uh, count toward all of these um, short-term certificates. So it's like you can earn these as you go through the program. Um, so uh, we would really, like for you to um, to contact us if you're interested in working in a doctor's office setting as a certified medical assistant or a coder, a phlebotomist, EKG tech. There's jobs all throughout uh, the Northeast Alabama area, Chattanooga, Gadsden. So we have students who have um, jobs in all of those places so we would like to uh, talk with you and just contact the the college and they will get you in touch with us thank you